Hello guys, welcome back to the another video. In today's video, I am going to discuss the University of Essex Applied Data Science course and the, how many modules are there, what is the weightage of each modules and how the each module is divided into how many parts like what is the weightage of that part as well. So I'm going to discuss each and everything for the Applied Data Science course because uh, I have done the same course and in the let's start to the video and do let me know in the comment section if you like the video and don't forget to subscribe. So this is the page you can see the overview uh, January start data or uh, you can see the course uh, details uh, the maximum years uh, duration one year hai, uh, and the location is Colchester campus and based in the this is the not the computer science department the you will be based in the mathematical uh, science department. So these are these are the core details and everything what you going to learn in this course and everything you can go through with the course structure we will go through this uh, each and every module. So if you check this module CE 150 156 and MA214 if you click on this you can see the compulsory and the optional module so you can choose any of the one module either in network analysis or an approach introduction to programming so both are i believe easy modules you can take any of them so in data visualization there was the project for individual project and they have given the data set for this module and 100 percent coursework is the project only. Uh, individual has to do the project only there is no test or anything like that just the project you have to do and if you talk about the programming and text analytics with r this module is divided into two parts so this module is divided into 40 and 60 percent so 40 percent will be the midterm r test that would be the online and 60 percent would be the project so ma331 will be the divided into two parts 40 percent and 60 percent 40 percent would be the online test multiple choice question and everything would be there and it's the online test only in my course so i don't know maybe they could be there would be chances they can change the pattern of the exam they might uh, change it but uh, most probably there would be the same course or the same pattern and the 60 percent would be the project where you have to individual has to do the project but the data set and everything will be given so let's talk about the ma332 sql uh, databases and sql1 module it is also divided into two parts which is the first is the sql lab test which is having the 40 percent of the wages and the final would be also the class test so it will be having it will be having the 60 percent weightage so ma triple one is divided into three parts uh, assignment one assignment two and the final test and the weightage was 10 percent for the assignment one or uh, 10 percent for the assignment two and 80 percent was for the final test for the ma9199 there is zero credit for this module i don't know why they have uh, like they are considering this module but anyway you this is the very simple module you just have to like write the simple answer and about yourself and if you go through with this module it's very simple very easy MA334 is divided into only one part you just have to submit the project and the data set and everything the questions and everything will be given so you have to do the individual project in this module for the MA335 data modeling and experimental data something so it is also divided into three parts final project was 50% lab test was 20% and the class test was 30% so this is the how this uh, MA335 module is divided into the percentage so if you talk about this MA336 artificial intelligence and machine learning with application module the assessment if you go in the Moodle page and you can see the assessment information online test is 20% and the final project is 80% so module is divided into two parts 20% and 80% so online test will be like the portal will be given it will open for the specific time period and you have to fill the answers online only so and the final project will be like you will be given the data set and some of the questions and you have to write code and report on that data set and you have to submit the project so for the MA335 modeling experimental and observational data it is also divided into three parts final project is the 50% weightage and there is a lab test and the class test so, so class test is 30% and the lab test is 20% so you have to consider everything so you don't have to pass individually but like you have to pass in each module yeah, overall like if the module is divided into 20 30 and 50 percent so you don't have to pass in individually like 20 percent you have to pass in 30 percent but overall you should be able to uh, get the uh, passing marks so then only you will you will get the 15 credit for the another module that is i mean 902 research method in this uh, module that is also divided into two parts ma 902 short report that is the uh, five percent and the ma 902 project essay 95 percent so module is divided into two parts 
MA902 short report 5% and MA902 project essay that is the 95%. So for MA334 data analysis and statistic with R, there is a 100% coursework that is the project data set would be given and you just have to submit the project right do your analysis and everything the question would be given so you have to work accordingly data set would be given and questions would be given so you have to uh, interpret your results and everything according to the questions and submit the project and the final module that is ma981 that is the dissertation so you will be given the lot of information about the dissertation because this is the final module and the credit of this module is very huge so you have to do the project very nice and clearly so that you will get the distinction or the top distinction and in applied data science there would be like the project was not given you are free to choose any data set any project so that was the best part some people feel this is the difficult because if the projects are given then you have to select from those list in case the projects are not defined then you have to research whether you are able to do this project or not so you can find a lot of projects from the Kaggle website or there are many other websites where you can find the data set and the data science project so you have to find the projects and do by your own data sets along with it and uh, like you have to just communicate or with your professor or the supervisor and you just have to submit the project so this all was from this वैसे तो और dissertation वाले project में क्या करना पड़ता है कि dissertation में आपको अगर project given है जो कि बहुत सारे courses में given होता है but हमारा जो applied data science का course है उसमें जो है Kaggle या किसी भी repository से आप data set उठा सकते हो plus project उठा सकते हो बस आपको करना क्या है कि अपने supervisor से आपको approval लेना है कि आप इस data set पे और इस project पे work कर रहे हो जब वो approve कर देगा और आपको उसको या Python पे कर रहे हो R पे कर रहे हो अगर वो आपसे angry करता है इस project पे और data set पे तब आप proceed कर सकते हो और वाला project कर सकते हो उस dissertation के लिए और बाकी ये जो कोर्स है डेटा साइंस एंड एप इन इट्स एप्लीकेशन इट्स ऑलमोस्ट सेम लाइक दो तीन मॉड्यूल्स ही चेंज है उसमें कोर्स वर्क थोड़ा बहुत चेंज है लाइक कुछ ग्रुप प्रोजेक्ट है बाकी ऑलमोस्ट दोनों कोर्सेज सेम है फीस भी इंटरनेशनल अगर उसकी देखोगे तो दोनों की सेम है कोर्स तो आपको पता ही है कि दोनों का एक ही साल का है और मतलब वन ईयर का ही है और ये एम एस सी डेटा साइंस एम एस सी अप्लाइड डेटा साइंस एम एस सी डेटा साइंस और एम एस सी ये अप्लाइड डेटा साइंस इन एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन ऑलमोस्ट तीनों सेम कोर्स हैं बट जो है अप्लाइड डेटा साइंस सिर्फ और सिर्फ जैन इन में अवेलेबल है और जो एप्लीकेशन वाला है वो भी शायद से जैन इन में ही अवेलेबल है मैं श्योर नहीं हूँ इस चीज़ के लिए और जो एम एस सी डेटा साइंस है वो सिर्फ और सिर्फ जैन सितंबर अक्टूबर इंटेक वाले में है जो वो अवेलेबल है सो आज की वीडियो के लिए इतना ही होपफुली की वीडियो आपको पसंद आई होगी भाई काफी मजा आता है हार्डवर्क लगा इस को बनाने में मेरे को तो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब वगैरह जरूर कर देना मिलते हैं किसी और वीडियो में तब तक ले बाय बाय